My name is Katrina Denham. I work for Bibby Offshore in the subsea industry as a CAD operator. In day to day role, um, I work in the tendering department. A tender is a potential job. The client send in the information they would want done in a job, um, and the tendering team, we then give them a specification, a set of drawings, some storyboards, and 3D animations along with a price, and then they tell us if we've won the job or not. So I get the information from the engineers and develop the deck plans and the storyboards in tandem and then if necessary on bigger jobs we do some 3D animation. I mean it's a lovely team to work in, there's quite a good bit of banter between all the teams. I start work at 8am and arrive here, the teams normally all start at 8 o'clock quite a good atmosphere in the team. Obviously I check with the engineer if there's any new tenders coming in and if they've got anything, any amendments they want to the drawings that I've left with them before I finish the previous night. And then get on with making those amendments or complete the drawings that I was working on the day before. Every subsea job needs drawings of some sort. I do deck layouts, which is the deck plan of the boat with the equipment shown on it for that job. And I also do storyboards which are an illustration almost going through the steps of a process. Before I was a CAD operator in the subsea industry, I was an architect. I switched to the subsea industry for the flexibility and also for the career progression options. I studied architecture at university in Aberdeen. And obviously that's quite a long course, it's five years for your degree and then two years for your masters to become an architect. But that gave me some good skills which are really transferable across to the subsea industry. I particularly like the subsea industry because as well as offering a challenging working environment, I can fit my family life around it. There are quite a lot of females in the oil and gas industry, in, in technical roles, in managerial roles and in executive roles as well. So girls, if you're sitting there thinking that you can't do it, or you might be scared to work in a man's world, it's not as bad as you think. Yeah. <laughs>